I'm just gonna show off my uh, simple, cheap plastic stands that I got from Harbor Freight. And then I just bought this um, plywood piece from Home Depot for like a $7. It works extremely well because I don't have to cut my uh, uh, wood on, on the ground level. I also bought a uh, Harbor Freight uh, circular saw here and it works really it works well. really well for me. It had a um, laser guided light here that I use quite a bit. So I'm, you know, I'm start using this. Um, there's a lot of videos showing you how to safely use this. And, you know, I basically have to buy the blade here, right here. It's like $7 from Harbor Freight. And uh, this saw costs about $39. It is the cheapest, um, you know, it, it uses electric, doesn't have any cordless or anything like that. But it, it, you know, for a beginner or for general purpose, I think this, this is really great. And also I have clamp here, it's really handy. You know, a couple of them to do woodwork extremely, you know, give you extra hands here. So keep your wood, you know, still and you don't need to worry about wobbling or anything like that. It's like uh, $4 per package I bought. It's come with a lot of uh, smaller clamps there. So that's pretty much my easy setup and I'm pretty happy with it. it it's, you know, if you guys haven't bought this, uh, you know, of course you can get a better, more sturdy stands here. But for me, it, it, it's working great. I just made quick and easy fruit tree branch support because my my uh, persimmon tree have a lot of uh, fruits and it's pretty heavy. So one of the branches is is, uh, uh, is very is very low. It's too low. So I'm creating this uh, just to support the this like a 14 inch long here. Make it this like a V. Uh, I guess like a V shape here on the other, you know, if you do it upside down. And uh, and this is my best. I'm not gonna dig the ground or anything like that. Basically, I'm just gonna just, you know, support the base with this one piece. It's not extremely stable, but um, we'll see how it goes. So that is pretty cool setup I have. I'm gonna go ahead and Put it underneath my branch now. It's just like a temporarily, I think it will, unless it's extremely windy, it's gonna stay okay. I support um, the base with some more wood chips underneath just to make it a little bit sturdy because the wind coming this way, so hopefully this base will kind of counter the wind here a little bit and then. Uh, It's like a little V there. Just a quick and dirty. It's working. Anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, we'll, we'll see you in the next video.